Hey, man. BRB. Hey man, you know, I had to, you know what I'm saying? I had to bring back the little beanie, you know what I'm saying? All my OGs who remember, I used to be a beanie guy. Not anymore, but I guess today is a special day. Anyways, you know what I'm saying? Speaking about day ones, you know what I just realized? The people that's watching this video right now, like when it's like recently posted, you guys are the day ones. And stick around, you know what I'm saying? Stick around, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm building an empire. And when everything is established and growing, I just want all the day ones that was here from the beginning to rise with me and grow with me and achieve with me. Y'all gonna be the biggest part in this whole operation. I'm just running it. <laughs> hey, hey, Ronald McDonald didn't make any money by himself. Think about that. Think about it. I don't know if that's true or not, but I, hey, it, it sounded good though. <laughs> Hey, but, uh, you know what I'm saying? I just wanted to uh, bring it back to a, uh, a little old school intro, you know what I'm saying? Where I'm just sitting here talking to y'all before the game starts, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, so, uh, yeah, y'all gonna get the same intro, though. But y'all gonna get two intros, you know what I'm saying? J2 time, you know? <laughs> JXX. <laughs> J extra. Extra. <laughs> oh, brother, this guy stinks! Alright, I'm gonna cut all that out. But, anyways, um, <clears throat> yeah. Let's hop into it. That's not what I say. Let's play some video games. <laughs> Last time on Walking Dead Z. As the group checked out of the drugstore, while everyone but Doug made it out safe and sound, the group checked into a motel visited by Lee and them. Glenn unfortunately was lost and had to go find enlightenment, so he left the crew. But the crew was still strong for the next three months. Three months later, Lee and a, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know who this is, and I don't know where he come from, but he locked in though, so. Anyways, they was looking for food for the crew until they stumbled upon some strangers that was in trouble. After helping the strangers get out of trouble, one of them didn't make it. I wonder why. Meanwhile, the crew had a little heated conversation on who should lead the pack. And who should do this and who should do that. But ultimately, Lee knows it should be him. Moments after they meet a couple of farmers and they come to bargain. What's next for the crew? Find out now on Walking Dead Z. All right, so we are in bay. Last Here time we is. left off. St. John Family Dairy. You know what I'm saying? Things have to be we done. See how we kept this people place have so to safe. go. New people came and the new people gone. You but now, you, they fry like bugs in a zapper. We're now we're at this different company. And we're, you know what I'm saying? we're talking with other companies. I'm going to seeing what we can lot. take and give, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Uh, this is a brilliant this is setup. A really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I 
saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the hey, St. Brenda. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Uh... Uh... I've got things under control over there. Well, I hope you know what you're doing. Me! That place isn't safe like it is here. Me! Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. I got my aura. Okay. Um, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We I'm gonna start saying me now. Comfortable. I'm gonna start running things. Uh... Does that offer apply to the rest of us? Yeah. We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole... I don't even know who, dude, who this dude is, but he's selling. What are you doing? So, I remember last episode, we told the op how many people we got. And we telling them who they roll are. Like, at this point, we might as well tell them, like, oh, oh we got we got kids, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and one of them a little, you know what I'm saying? So, like, whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? What are you doing, bro? I forgot your I'll name. Prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Yeah. Take that crash out. Mark. Hey, Lee, remember, Lily. Why don't you take or a Carly, look Carly. Once you get remember. settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Save yourself. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. Yeah, I got you, you my boy. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Uh... We should do whatever we can to help out. Let, uh, let's just make sure... Yeah, let's... Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna... I'm bruh, I'm gonna build up Lee's ore, bruh. He gonna get, but he gonna by by the end of this episode, if I can, he gonna be the leader of the group. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Yeah. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe, but is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Yeah. All right. I'll keep my eyes open. Look, look, look for the you can for look that. for the weak spots. You know what I'm saying? Look, look for any little cranny or or opening of anything. Let me go talk to you real fast, though. I'm looking at everything. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. I got you, my boy. I don't know who you who you are. I got you though. You can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. Yeah. So a little bucket of water won't hurt anybody. That's all I need. And if you think about it, bro, I mean, it's, it, it is zombie proof, but it ain't human proof, bro. I'm, man, I'm diving through the middle right there. You know? <laughs> so, yeah, uh, let's, let me go check out this swing right here. I'm checking everything. I'm looking for any weakness. Too bad it's broken. 
I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Uh... Mind yeah. if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Yeah. Yeah. I like... Man. Man. Yeah. Make, make a... Make, hey, sometimes you just gotta build your trust. I got an axe. So I think I can chop some wood later or something. Uh, nah, I'm not... I don't wanna use that roof. Oh, actually... Nah, let me go talk over here. Let me see this first. Hmm. Pointy. Yep. Okay, Andy. What you doing, Andy? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I yep. noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Anyone Nobody messes with us. Yeah. They'll regret it. Yeah, nobody well, messes with her. Protecting your people is important, but in my experience, having that many guns around is when people get dangerous. Uh, let me see. So, should I ask about the fence, or should I ask about people they saw? Let's go fix the perimeter. I want to ask everything. Uh, here, let me just ask a safety question. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Okay, you found out other survivors have stayed at the farm. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? Is that what you call them? That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. You know, like us. Oh. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Wait, let me fix the swing for you. You never know. My bad. My so bad, how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just... it popped out. I mean, you did admit it right to his face. Uh... I, I try, try to, to be civil at least. Yeah. He's too busy being cranky to notice. There's one. Dang. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Who do you think he was? Uh, Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh. Wait, so the game is Looks calling like them zombies. Stuck. 
Well, use your axe. <laughs> Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. Disgusting. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Uh... Yes. Well, it's useless without gas. Yeah. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Mm. We've got enough people to take this place by force if we have to. Yeah. Seriously, you sound like Kenny. There's another one. I see it. I'm sorry. Sometimes, sometimes in life, you gotta take what's yours. And if it wasn't yours, take it anyway. Thanos didn't become Thanos without being Thanos. Think about it. Stay with me now. Stay with me now. What's wrong with you? Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. Alright, let me just... <laughs> yep. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Bruh, I fed the kids. Just try to focus on the task. Yeah, exactly, bro. They knew I what fed they were you. doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Dang. You got hops? Oh, snap. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Ah! Ah! What the? Get to the gate. What just happened? Get down! You asshole! Jesus! We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out! You think I can't see ya? Uh... Who the fuck are you? Hey, let's talk we this don't out! Know you. We don't mean you any harm! Bruh! Damn it. Leave me alone! I see you! You are not gonna pull that thing out. We had an agreement! Now you're fucked! Bruh, what I do sound like, uh... What's his name? From Black Panther. What did it, what did we do? We're not the St. John! Stop shooting at him! Shooting. Stop shooting! <laughs> oh my god, just just push it, bro. What is going on, bro? What are you doing? Help! Bro, I don't care about your arm. I don't even know what to do. are stuck in the dirt. The plates are stuck in the dirt. We had a deal. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Push it. Help me. How is it still stuck? It's still blocking it. I see him. I got you now. Behind the tractor. Come on. 
Right, if we can reach we the gate, we everybody can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Yep. 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 Uh, look at me. Uh, look at me. Uh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hey, y'all didn't see that. Y'all didn't. Holy fuck! I gotta start all the way from the beginning. The are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Who are these people, though? Are what these the bandits they was talking about? Like, why is it? Why is it? Why is it always something? Who the fuck is that? No Who are you? Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out. And let me, let me take this out. And then take this out. Right. Come on, if we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to right, the let's house. Let's just do this for right now. Bro, what is going on, though, bro? <laughs> My boy Lee got Ultra Instinct. Look, look, look. Look, wait, 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 wait. Ready, 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 ready. What no happened? way. It's one of the dead we pushed down early. We're gonna have to move it. Move that thing. Use it as a body. Ready, watch this Ultra Instinct. Ready, ready, ready. Ready, 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 ready. But there's no way. How many of those things did we push down? Only two. But if you don't do something, bro, you you got it. Please do something. 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 Please don't do something. Please. Mmm. Yeah. All right, bro. Come on. All right, bro. You really made a choice, but it's okay though, cause when an opportunity presents itself, I know what I gotta do. I know exactly what I must do. Let's get out of here. That was insane what you just did to me. Come on, let's get back. You had another arm, bro. I don't care, bro. You could have at least put a little Wait, leg room. What's wrong? Uh. The electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we yeah. got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit! Are are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards wait. in the woods, mama? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Uh-uh, he's a double agent. Uh-uh, he a back door. Cause remind me if I'm wrong. But the fence turned on, he got shot, and then he screamed. Nah, hey, pay attention to that. Pay attention to that. I'll be all right once it's out, but god damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you going to be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> Look I at Larry. Pull it out. Oh, no, honey, come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must hey, be this the first what kind person? of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Maybe yeah. it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. 
Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are we're ready serious? right now. This place is uh -uh. safe. We can't stay We're here. ready right not now. Not safe. This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope you kids like swings. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah! Oh, so he ended up fixing it. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Okay, bet. Uh, if it ain't anything I can grab, because I already looked at everything. Um, let's go scope it out. You know what I'm saying? Hey, my hey, one of my men got hit. Even though like he off to a bad start, that's still my man's though. I gotta, I gotta go get back. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I ain't going for any of that. I ain't doing it. <sighs> Excuse me. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in ships. Yep. Let me see. Lots of hay. Ugh. Enough of these might work as that. Oh now, my god. If that becomes a problem. I was about to say, what's going on in the background? <laughs> Alright, let's speed things up. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Yep. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Yep. What's up here? Bro, let me talk to you, bro. What's wrong with you, bro? We need to have a sit-down conversation, bro. Because what's ever on your feet, bro, is the reason why you mad at me. Because that's ridiculous. That's crazy work. Watch, watch, me, watch me talk to your uh, daughter, though. Watch how I do this. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? Uh... Uh... I wish I could say everything. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? You're a good leader, Lily. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if yeah. you two could try to work together once in a while. Yeah. If anything, bro, I'm I'm gonna take I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna steer the ship. Let me see if hey. I can still talk to him. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. 
It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Does he treat you like that, too? <clears throat> Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All okay. he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So okay. don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. And, and I respect that, you know? Think our little arrangement with them was a good idea? A little late to be asking that now, don't you think? Dad's right. Let's just wait for dinner. And then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. Now, now, let's not be hasty. I'm gonna go check Oh, now nah, you don't want to Just don't hasty. get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. But if anybody's going to get us kicked out, it's you, bro. Because I'm tired of your mouth, bro. I'm going to go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. All right, for sure. Thank you, Carly. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I love... Yeah. <laughs> but wait, I love... Nah, not yet. <laughs> All right, come on. That man just keeps staring at me. That thing keeps a fence electrified. Oh, yeah. Good job, Lee. You have common knowledge. Good job. All right, let me go look over here. I'm going to just go check in on Clementine. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? It's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. Sure. Happy to push you on this way. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Yeah, let me just tell him. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. Yep. How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? Nah, he'd You're be straight. Out there. It'd have been a lot worse. Mark gonna be good. Are you going to find Mark a warrior. Who hurt Mark? Man, we have to make sure they Yeah, we're gonna track him else. down. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Nah, tuh. Uh... I'm not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. Yeah. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay, thanks for pushing me. Of course, it's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck, don't pop a gasket. Uh, alright, why not? Let's just talk to Kenny. That's my man. I'll talk to everybody else. Where are you going? I don't think this game wants me to talk to Kenny. Let's see. Hey. Hey, Lee. Found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. Alright, I got you. Uh... I guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. 
I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with yeah. me on this, right? Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Lily's judgment is clouded. Wait, what am I you doing? Have a pretty clear head about these things. But it, but it's gonna be a part where like they come up and start arguing and be like, oh wait, Lee said this, but Lee told me this, and then I'm gonna just look stupid. I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. I need to start picking a here, side, bro. Dizzy, hands shaking. Cold but I really want to lead so myself. Pass though. out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? No, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he, he never Katja looks good. An easier life here. That's funny. He didn't seem too worried about Duck when Larry wanted to throw him out into the street back in Macon. That's in the past, Kenny. A lot's happened since then. Yeah, right. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'll I be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John. I thought you was my boy. What happened? Bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Why are you pushing him so hard? I'm not talking to your son. You can miss me with that. I right, for sure, my boy. You keep talking to me like that. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? It ain't uh, going in well. I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. Yeah. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell exactly. yeah. Who yeah. the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. Think hey, so why his, like, angry animations the same? <laughs> Save lives. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell <laughs> get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? <laughs> Bro, why he said... He said, he said... the woods. <laughs> uh, let's go. Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll yep. stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Yeah, I'm telling you, bro, he's a double agent, bro. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. What does that mean? Please be lucky. Where your hat at? See anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. Let's lock in. Oh shit, you found it? Shall we get closer? You see anybody? Nah. Stay on guard. Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the ten. Lock in. Lock in, Lee. Uh, can't you see? Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. 
There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Alright, for sure. Stay on guard though. Hey, hey, hey. Yo, 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 yo. Keep that thing eye level. Get ready for anything. You in yeah, enemy territory. Or you're in neutral territory. Or you're just in territory Indeed. in general. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Exactly, so that's what I'm saying. Nothing but fuels. Shit. Examine everything. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Mm. This is too much stuff for just one person. Yeah. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Ooh! Well, would Boxes you look at that? Dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Yeah, we'll take that back. Yeah, we'll take all of it. Take it. What are you doing? Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. I mean, let me let, let me look what's inside. looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. What did you just? All right, let's just keep going. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Yep. Look at everything. Empty. This this one of the filler episodes, y'all. So you know what I'm saying. Grab that. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. That bro, is dead. Though. Not right now, oh, bro. Good. What else they got over here? Let's just, see if we can just, find anything useful. Just grab it and, and yeah, home. put that in your pocket, bro. And worry about something else. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. How'd I tell him no? Crate? Let's look at the crate. In the meantime, my bad. Nothing. Alright. My bad, y'all. <clears throat> I think I looked at everything. Yeah, that's everything. Yeah, that's everything. Yeah, that's everything. <laughs> what else am I supposed to grab? Wait, I looked at the kettle, right? The kettle. Just oh. water. That thing hot right now. Am I tripping? My boy Lee. That's alright, my man. You gonna lead one day. Uh, if not lead, you gonna like you, you important. You, you, you that you that man. <laughs> you that guy. I already looked inside the tent. Take that bunny. Ah, uh, nah, never mind. Don't take it. The hell? Don't you fucking move. Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. 
What the fuck happened? You had to deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know Shoot her! You are, and I know she took Clementine hat. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal uh, everything from me. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last year. Shoot week. her! I asked you, sweet. Put your damn guns down! You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Man. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the yeah. fucking same to you. You shot Mark, you psycho bitch. Yeah. Who the fuck is Mark? I don't know any Mark. You shot him at the dairy. The fuck I did. That's them other people. These good buddies with your boyfriend here. I guess you met him. Ain't they nice? Oh. You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. That's enough. No. I heard enough. I'll wave them guns like you're looking. I heard die. enough. Goodbye. Who just shot her? Who just shot her? Shit! What the hell'd you do that for? We had a deal with them. Uh, yeah. She was about to shoot. She was about to shoot us both. You could have just taken her down. You didn't have to kill her. Nah, we good. I mean, I know she was crazy, but damn. Nah, we good. I made the right choice, I think. <sighs> she took limit time hat, bruh. It's a clean shot, though. You got to right go. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Yep. Still, what a waste. Yep, nope, it wasn't. So, that's it. I don't Going regret back? it. If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Take the arrow. Take, yep. Hey, so what was you saying? What was you saying? Come I, on. I, I, what? Hold on, let me take it off. What was you saying? I can't hear you. Oh, that's right. You want to flow. Psst. Lee. Lee, you did the right thing. You know what I'm saying? You did the right thing, Lee. You did the right thing. This 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 is how you this is how you get your aura. Just like Man, this. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? What? You were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. Yeah, I did. You're back. What happened? Lee took care of it. Yep. Sooner or later, you're not going to start feeling bad. I well, already don't. What Terry would have wanted. Terry? Who's My Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Well, Y'all stay be arguing, What's going bro. on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all. What you know about squabbling? Uh, they have different ideas about how yeah. we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. Yeah, exactly. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry, and people get a little stir crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. Nah, trust me. You ain't seeing everything. Don't wander too see. far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. You're welcome. What's what's all them awards on your on your on your, on your house? Hey Clementine, I got something for you. Come here. Not like that. Go give it her. Uh-uh. We ain't wasting no time. Alright, let me go talk to let me go talk to them again, bro. 
Hey, since Kenny, Kenny, since, bro, since Kenny, like, like, I don't know what I did to him, but since he on that, on that, on that, on that, on that, on that bull crap, let me go side with Lily. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more? Bro, I shot a crazy girl, bro. Uh, we found a tent. tent and some boxes. Nothing really useful. Seriously, no food? Jesus. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here, and we don't need to be overstaying. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, he might not be wrong. Are. The way I see it, we that just one need to dude, skip the dinner uh, and get our Andy, food to I go. Think Andy, I think Andy, there's some, there's some, up with Andy, bro. Do you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. Bro, Larry These right, kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. We should, we should, we should at least try to stay. You know what I'm saying? Chill, Lily. I got you. Uh, you in my hands now. You gonna be mine. I'm gonna be yours. We gonna be together. Hey, Clem. Miss Clemmy girl. Clement time. Aww. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. But ain't that crazy, bro? It's okay. Go ahead. Whoa! Ain't that crazy how I found out a hat Mabel though? could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? <laughs> All right, I'm not. I'm not touching any of that. I'm gonna talk to you. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah. He uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. How's the cow? Well, better now we got. You know exactly who that woman is. What well, was? Um, when do you think? Uh, right, let's sum up with you, man. Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Thanks. Yep. All right, now let me check in. How do you like that let cow, Clint? She's pretty. And then look, Clementine. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it! You said you would! Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Uh... I'd like to someday. Yeah, Maybe a little someday. Girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, You're welcome Clementine. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Uh, I thought just have to check. Uh, all right. I think that's everything. This is a this is a nice filler episode, you know. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? 
What about Clem? Uh, I'll protect her yeah. no matter what. I know you will. All the other Look, answers are lying. Guy with Katya. What's Come his on, name? Bro. He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. But, so... Uh... Are, are y'all just like having this conversation with the dude that locked this is literally like 10 feet away? Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban. Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hmm. Nah, bro, I didn't, bro. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cat. Nah, it's not for you. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Uh. Just, just checking. checking out the barn yep. here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about you. I should have asked. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. I thought I was Andy. I should have asked what's behind the door. Hey guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Let's track the Andrew to get him out the bar. All right. All right, for sure. Empty. All right, there ain't nothing for us in here. There ain't nothing nowhere. All right, uh. Hold on. I still can't get that lock off the door. Hmm. You probably just yeah. need a screwdriver or something. Bro, why are you talking so loud, bro? Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. I got you. I think it's something. Bro, what's behind the door, bro? Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while, raid our stuff. Even with the fence. Oh. You got a screwdriver? For what? Uh, uh, never mind. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Lee, I ain't gonna lie. You lost a couple aura points. But hey, he at least he at least he gone now. Come on, use the door. Come on. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Woo! I don't know how you teleported, but you just gain extra aura points from that teleportation. Dang, I'm at two deaths now. I just realized. So, how does a woman like yourself? What you trying to do? Place? Oh, I managed just fine. Plus, I had my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. My boy trying to go crazy. 
Alright, so how do I get Andy outside? Ooh, now now me and Lily got a long time. A little on alone time with Lily here. Hey Lily baby. Come here, baby. What's wrong? What's the matter? What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? Uh there may be something going on with that barn. Yeah. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Yeah. Watch yourself, Lee. Oh, you starting to care about me? Aw. You say you love me? <laughs> wait, wait, when do you say you, wait, 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 Lily, when do you say you love me? Lily, when do you say you love me? Please. Ple hey, 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 when hey, when do you say you love me? Do you love me now? Or later? Now? You love me? Nah, okay. Did I just accidentally make a TikTok sound? <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. Ain't nobody gonna clip that. Oh, uh, ooh, two box, toolbox. Dang, I wasn't thinking. A multi tool. That should be handy. Yep, grab it. Just gonna borrow this for a second. I needed a screwdriver, but if a couple of tools out in the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor inn. Exactly. Alright, now I got uh pliers, I believe. Uh let me see. Hey, my boy, whatever, hey, what what happened at the camp stays at the Hello. camp, and I hope you know that. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry, too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are lucky you're on this side of the deal now. Yeah. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. Damn. You really like that guy. What's not to like? Not too much. Uh, not yeah. Much, not too much, I guess. Exactly. I I'm gotta start. Wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. I gotta start like, uh, like talking to these people. How I just like, like talk and respond by myself. But like the answers they be giving me ain't the answers I would be saying for real, bro. Or if it is, we'll, like, uh, we'll finish talking later. You been getting along with Larry? <laughs> he just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know I forgot what I was saying. Those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you oh yeah, look, like if it is like they be saying it, they be doing it too fast. I can't even like process my answers. Uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, so what are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? Me. I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. But why is it locked up, though? If it ain't interesting. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, 
they can hold their own. Uh, why did you make a deal with those people? Yeah. We got a threat of humanity left, Lee. We can do more good without them in our hair by placating them. So that's what we do. Okay. How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Bruh. Well, go have a look around. Kinda peaceful out here. Bruh, I can't, like, Enjoy go see my can. boy that, that's not my boy because I don't know him. I don't, I forgot his name. Well, his name is Mark. He just said it. But he been he he just been L man's recently. He ain't been like working good. He ain't been doing nothing for this country. <laughs> he been doing nothing for this economy. Alright, let me see. Hey, what's behind that barn? Cause I really wanna know now. Uh, hey there, Andy. Yeah. So, uh, where do you keep the rest of the tools? Well, if you need something, just tell me what it is, and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. Daddy um, needs something again. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. All right, let's hurry up, let's hurry up. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Go, 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 go. Actually, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. So how do I get in this door? I tried distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What about those generators? I picked up uh, something I think could help with the lock. All right. Good to hear. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, all right, yeah, maybe he's right. Uh, Duck, what you got to say, Duck? Or right, here, let me look at the camera. She looks skinny. What you got to say, Have Duck? Have I missed anything? No. Not really. Hmm, it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> she said duty. But this is this is a this is really a good episode, filler episode. Y'all know filler episodes. I know what a filler is, right? Hi, right, let me see. He said generators. Oh, excuse me. My bad, y'all. I'm glad Andy knows how to fix this if something goes wrong. I'm Kick it. about this stuff. Power switch. Yep. Yep. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. So it has to be something. Hello. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Bro, when is dinner, bro? I'm starving, bro. I'm starving Marvin. <laughs> Pardon me, Brenda. What's on your mind, Lee? When will dinner be ready? Should be ready before too long. What does that mean? 
Nah, for real though, what does that mean? Bro, I can eat a cow, bro. That's how starving I am. I'm about to eat that calendar. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. There gotta be something else on here. Or how about I just keep doing it? And just go back and run, run, run. Again? Oh, maybe I just keep doing it. Oh, the outlet. Let's go look at the outlet. Yeah. Doesn't look very safe, but I guess that's the point. Yeah, let's do it one more time. Surprised, like the mom or the brother ain't seeing what I'm doing. Okay, and the door open now. The door wasn't open last time. But I don't know how to distract them, bro. I'm clueless. At least we got people to talk to. Let me talk to Larry. So, Larry, it uh, looks like you're getting along with Brenda pretty well. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? Hey, I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. I'm not watching myself. He needs to watch himself. His days are numbered. Yeah, I'm completely like lost on what to do though. And I don't want to look it up like what to do. Because then that's cheating. Let me see. He keeps on turning on the generator. I tried distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What are you talking about, man? Do, do I pour water on the generator? Well, then again, that's like messing up like what they got going on, man. I'm, if I'm doing all this, just wait. There's a bucket right here. Okay. I mean, not a bucket. That's a water fountain right there. Let's look for a bucket. Or like uh, gazebo. What's in the gazebo? Wait. Doesn't offer much in the way of protection, though. That's all you have to say. Bro, come on, bro. Bro, walking dead. Give me a hint. <laughs> Please. I looked at, I touched, and I did everything. They go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. Yep. That's cool. Oh, he's about to say sharp. Nope. 
I need a bucket. Mm. Uh oh. Some new stuff. They're storing gasoline all over the property. That's a nice observation, Lee. Why not let's look for something that can uh no mail coming in or out these days. At least they don't have to worry about bill collectors anymore. <gasps> uh, what are you even saying, bruh? You just yapping. You're not even talking anymore. Yeah, bro, I have no idea like what to do. Let me try going in here one more time. Pardon me, Brenda. What's on your mind, Lee? When will dinner be ready? Should be ready before too long. I don't even know what that means. I think I'm going insane. Am I doing something right? Is the game glitched? I really think the game's glitched. Power switch. Oh. Oh, my bad. Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. I got one. There you go. Cut that thing. Ow! Damn it! The thing is moving fast. Oh. There we go. There. That should do it. Close it. What are you doing? Danny, where did he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, dog. Ah, son of a fuck. Oh, this take forever. Uh-oh, he's distracted. Should I, should, I, should I talk to him? Does it give me the opportunity? Hey, my man. Take care of that thing. I don't know why I was sitting right behind you. My bad. All right. Uh. All right. Now he's distracted. Let's let's get into some business now. Wait. Do I tell Kenny? Time. It's dinner time. Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad, Dad, come on, let's eat. Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on, don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. I got you, I got you. I really want to go eat, though. Come on. Uh oh, I'm, I'm actually getting scared. I'm actually getting scared. I ain't gonna lie. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Dinner time. What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Oh, 
<laughs> we got to end it right there. We have to end it right there. On a little cliffhanger. This man, I do not trust this man. I don't know what this man got going on, but I... I nah. <laughs> no, man. No. So that'll be it for him, man. And I apologize for this filler episode, yeah. Ain't, ain't really much going on on this episode, except for, like, the end, obviously. So I do apologize. And, uh, yeah. I'm still enjoying it, though. Still, I'm still having fun. Still, still being my own person. Being my own man. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Let me take this thing off. I really appreciate y'all watching that video, man. Hey, like the video. Subscribe if you're new. Hi. Welcome. Wait, what did I say? Dang, I already forgot. Wait, like the video. Subscribe if you're new. Welcome to my channel. Like and subscribe. <laughs> I don't even know if I said that right. But, uh. Yeah, man. That's the end. I'll catch y'all soon. I'll catch y'all real soon. <laughs> oh, man. But, uh, yeah. That's the end. Uh, is there anything else I have to say before I go? Oh, yeah. Um... Let me know if y'all want me to get into any other games, cause I I can I can either just finish this out, or I can just dilly dabble into other games. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, I ain't really tripping. Like I just want to do what y'all want. You know what I'm saying? Whatever y'all want, I got y'all. I'm your guy. <laughs> Anyways, man, I'm having fun, and I'm coming back. Well, obviously I'm coming back, but I'm having fun, and I'll, I'm, you won't see this face. <laughs> Anyways, I've been here for too long, but, uh, yeah, y'all have a good one.